Hi everyone. Right, now you've probably got one of these uh, A7 M3s. Yeah, I think that's the name of it. Bloody brilliant camera. But they're quite complicated if you're a bit of a novice or a bit of a nana like I am. In fact, I spent ages trying to find out where the eye autofocus was. And I introduced a friend, David, uh, to the Sony. And he's learnt so much more about it. But the trouble is, you see, he... He, he just absorbs things a lot more quickly than I am because he's three years older than I am. So uh, he's just a bit more bright. Um, OK, so we'll start by looking at the camera. Hi, right, here we have the camera. We're going to press Menu. And we're going to go all the way up to the top. And we're going to go to the camera 2. Right, so we've got camera 2. We move down and we're going to go to page 8 of 9. So we're on page 8. Now, what I'm doing here is I'm setting up what key I want to press on here, OK, to operate uh, the eye autofocus. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to set it to the custom key. You can set it to anything you like. Right. Uh, well, that didn't work, did it? Ugh. What's happened there? Oh, custom key. Right, so go, right, custom key. So, I go down the custom key and I go to AEL button, which is page 3 of 3. Right. OK, so I select that and it's now I autofocus. Press the menu button again, menu button again. So, we're back at the main screen. Right, now we're on the main screen. Right, I'm going to go to camera 1. So, up again, camera one. Down, right. Then I'm going to go to page six of 14. So in the corner here, you see it going to six of 14. Right, now I go down to face eye autofocus set. Press that. Right, then I go to animal eye display is on, right, and we've got subject detection human right so in here you can see we've got a human and we've got a pussy so basically if you're taking pictures of humans you select the human if you're taking lots of pictures of pussies right you select pussy right so it's got an automatic eye detection for pussies right so just to run through that again face eye detection set then you select select subject detection it's on animal at the moment and it's got animal eye display on which shows a little picture of an animal eye display right so i'm going to put it back to human so that's one up okay now one thing that uh confuses quite a few people is you've set it to this and you think right okay there's there's a human i want to eye focus and you press that briefly and then you press the fire button to try and focus and bugger all happens that's because you've got to keep this button pressed for it to detect an eye. So all the time you want eye autofocus, you've got to keep the same button you programmed pressed. OK, thank you very much. Goodbye.